Greetings to each of you on this Monday, October 1, Memorial of St. Therese of the Child Jesus. I am Sister Pat Phillips, SHCJ, and I'm delighted to be with you today to talk about this saint and her little way. St. Therese was born, the last of nine children, to Louis and Zelie Martin on January 2, 1873 in France. Her mother died when she was only four, and her siblings doted on her. She claims to have had a conversion experience at age 14 on Christmas Eve, 1886. When she reached 16, she entered the Carmel Convent in Le Zoo. She died of tuberculosis on September 30, 1897 at age 24. She was canonized by Pope Pius XI in 1925. Her autobiography is entitled, The Story of a Soul. What made this young woman a saint and a doctor of the church? She is quoted as saying, what matters in life is not great deeds, but great love. She lived her life doing the ordinary with extraordinary love. She was simple and focused and trusting as a child is. Her spirituality is known as the little way. She believed that little things count, a smile, a note of encouragement, a phone call or a text, suffering in silence, always having a positive word. These ordinary things done with extraordinary love. Don't you think that's why she captured so many hearts so quickly? I remember hearing her story when I was a young religious sister trying to find my way in convent life. Her little way was so possible. We read of so many saints who did extraordinary things, were great in many ways. That's all good, but it's helpful to have St. Therese showing us how to become holy by doing ordinary things. What a relief, right? Have a great day and do one of St. Therese's little things today.